Hello, my name is Anthea Sivat and from the Karolinska Institute in Sweden. I believe that George Owa would be happy if he knew that people are still making games of words 80 years past the publication of his famous book, The Animal Farm. In fact, my research bears a curious parallel. When we draw curves to understand complex phenomena around us, we might just be looking at a simplified version of reality. For example, we all know how a pig looks like, yet we all imagine them slightly differently. This one, for instance, is a bit more square, while this one is rounder. None of them is totally wrong, but neither is totally right. The same applies for mathematical models. I use models in the benchmark those modeling approach, the so-called BMD. It assesses the potential association between a dose and the response or outcome, such as enzymatic changes in the liver following ethanol intake. In my research, I have shown three things. Firstly, that the BMD is applicable not only to chemical risk assessment, what it is mostly known for, but also to the pharmaceutical development, for instance, safety assessment of in vivo studies. You can refine these studies by extracting more information from the data in comparison to a bit more traditional approaches such as the NOWELL and statistical testing. In other words, you get more information for your money. The NOWELL approach is old and might be the gold standard, but perhaps it is time for the field to move forward and refine moving into a bit more advanced approach. Secondly, the BMD is useful to assess chemical mixtures. While we are all exposed to different chemicals in different concentration and mixtures throughout the day, BMD can help you understand the contribution of chemicals in the mixture to the outcome. Thirdly, that focusing on a single critical endpoint might be a limited way of looking at things. If you examine all of the endpoints for which data was collected, you might get a better understanding of the changes that you just observed. In conclusion, benchmark those modeling might not be the solution to all of your problems, but it definitely helps a lot to characterize the risk that certain chemicals might represent to human health. Thank you for your time and goodbye. on and because uh, <clears throat> my I'm not feeling this one but uh, hello oh, no I can't say hello because I need five seconds I stammered a bit but uh, I guess it will never be perfect